Shalom, everybody. Welcome to this week's edition of Loving and Living the Word from YeshuaSquare.com, the website that brings Christians together. And we're here to teach you the Word of God um, for your uh, own life, to help you and to give God glory and uh, to fight the demonic realm. So today's, this is daily devotionals for men and women uh, for, uh, for God's glory to learn the Word of God. So today's verse is from Psalms, Psalm 85, 12. And it says, Indeed, the Lord will give what is good. Indeed, the Lord will give what is good. So God is telling you here that he's going to give you what is good for you. He's not going to give you something that's bad for you. He's not going to put a person in your uh, path that's uh, bad for you. He's going to put somebody in your path who's good for you and who suits you and um, who's able to help you and encourage you and um, bring you uh, forward in your calling and um, who compliments you. So um, it's saying, indeed, the Lord will give you what is good. So a father doesn't give a, a child something that's bad for them, does does he? He gives his children things that will help them and um, will make them grow and um, will encourage them and uh, will bless them. And, um, you know, the, what God gives to us is good because um, he's a good father and he loves each one of us as his children. If you're born again and you believe that Jesus died for you, you're, you know, and you've repented. Um, you are a born again believer and you will enter the kingdom of heaven when you die. So um, you're a child of God uh, once you become born again. So um, there is nothing more beautiful than knowing and being born again because you know your destiny is with heaven and with those who have made it. And it's, they do speak about it. The, the Bible speaks about it as being a narrow way and few find it. So you must be born again. You must believe in Jesus that he died and rose again and have repented to enter the kingdom of heaven. The next step, obviously, is to be filled with the Holy Spirit. And um, every believer should be running after that as well and wanting it and seeking it and asking the Lord to fill them up with the Holy Spirit um, and to baptize them in the Holy Spirit so they can speak in tongues and prophesy. So um, there, God never gives you anything that's not good for you. So it does say very clearly in the word, indeed, the Lord will give what is good. So God's going to give you something that's good for you. He's never going to give you something that's bad for you. He's going to give you something that's good. Okay. So his gifts are good. Uh, he doesn't give any bad gifts to uh, his children and he loves his children and he loves you. So um, he's, he, he's, he's, he's giving you what is good for you. Okay. It's good medicine. All right. God bless you. I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Bye for now.